Hallelujah. Uh, once again, we want to thank our Lord because He's the one who is almighty. What is impossible unto the people? What is impossible unto our nation? Even what is not possible to our people? What is not possible to those? What is not possible to our people? Unto God, it is possible. And Lord, we want to thank you because what is not possible before us, what is not possible unto the man, unto you, God, it is possible. And even this month of June will be possible. And this month of June will be possible. In the name of our Lord Jesus, in every situation we are in, in COVID-19, what is impossible to the youth, it is going to be possible to you. You are going to be able to heal us. You will heal us because you are able. You will heal us because you are able. You are going to see us through because you are able. You are going to make us overcome because you are able. We want to thank our God is able to give As we give him a mighty hand clap and say thank you. Whatsoever has failed us. Whatsoever failed us. You are going to work it out in Jesus. Hallelujah. Amen. Uh, once again, we want to welcome you on every channel on which you are. We want to welcome you. And we want to continue thanking you. We want to thank you. Because you allowed, you agreed. The anointing that is upon our lives. And you are following us on Facebook, WhatsApp, on every media. In Jesus' mighty name. And as we speak always, that this month is a month of prophecy. It is a month of prophecy. Whatsoever we speak under the anointing of God, it is going to work out in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Amen. It is a month of prophecy. We began with Luke. Uh, we began with Luke chapter 1 and verse 26 and the verse was 26 when the angel Gabriel visited the family of uh, uh, Elizabeth and uh, Joseph sorry and Mary, Maria he came with the good news which came from above which came from God the angel Gabriel told him that I have been sent that God has sent me I've come, I've come from the throne of God with a message uh, Mary you're going to bear a child and he's going to be a powerful child and he's the same angel that came from heaven and he was sent to the family of Elizabeth and Zachariah the Bible says that in the same six months somebody say that in the same Month. We have also decided in this six months that we are going to believe God. The God who sent the angel in this very month, the six months, that together also he will send us some angels. Hallelujah. Amen. And we say that let us add on an act of faith. That let us do some act of faith which is uh, lining with uh, number six. Hey. You can decide that I will pray six times in a day. Somebody is saying that won't I work? You can say that uh, Let me pray for ten minutes. Let me pray for uh, But I feel feel number six. 
na yembe renga nziki ntukiri ze namba omukaga mukama wa feye baziwe amen era tubadde tuogera and we are continuing to pray nti osobola okusiga ensigo that you can sow a seed no kiriza katonde yacha eyatuma malaika and you believe god who sent the angel no sige ensigo ya nusu kakaga and you sow a seed of 6000 kakaga you can sow a seed of 6000 no sige mitwalo mukaga you can sow 60000 osobola kusige emitwalo nkaga even it can be that you sow 600000 osobola kusiga milioni mukaga or even 6 million shillings okusinzira nga mukama bwaku wadde according as god has given unto you okusinzira nga mukama bwaku gabiride according to how god has provided unto you okusinzira nga bochiulira according to how you feel within yourself you can say that i'm going to give in a sacrifice people decide to give in sacrifice and they sow the seed and he say that uh, enough is enough with poverty let me sow my 60000 but ladies and gentlemen the god we serve right from entebe miracle center There is no one who has sown a seed. And he has not harvested it. And if you sow, there is no doubt that you are going to harvest something. Can somebody clap for the Lord? Amen. I don't forget to give in the tithe. I continue to give in the offering. In the mighty name of Jesus. And as yesterday we said, That let us be people who are mindful of the kingdom of God. People who are mindful of the work of God. When we are working on the things of God. We need to continuously work on the things of God. As we are working on the things of God, God is going to work on our issues. I say that God is also going to work on our issues. In fact, Zakaria, Zakaria. Ah, uh, in fact, uh, Zakarias. Bawa Elizabeth. Are they f- the husband to Elizabeth? Bible ya ganti malaika ya musanga awereza. The Bible says that the angel found him when he was ministering. Ya musanga wayo bubani. He was offering the incense. Ya musanga agenze mu mu temple agenze kuwereza. He found him in the temple when he had gone to minister. Bela ko chokola. A lady is angel to me. Malaika wa mukama bele ko cha kusanga ngo kola. The angel of the Lord will find you doing something. Mulinyala mukama wa Yesu. In the mighty name of Jesus. Bela ko chokola cho bwa katonda. Do something which is godly divine. Bela ko chokola ekina kwata ku katonda. Do something that will touch God. Abantu abasinga mu Bible. Many of the people within the Bible. Mukama be awereza nga ba malaika. Whom God could send to the angels. Abamu. Some of them. Babera nga kebi mu ba mazokola. They had at least said something before. Eri katonda. Unto God. And then they could stir up the heart of God. And God was touched by their act. And then he would send them free. He would send his angels in the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah. hallelujah. Somebody shout hallelujah. Can I hear that great hallelujah? Lord, we want to thank you once again today. We want to thank you for the word we are given us. It is going to act as medicine in our hearts. It is going to act like a fire. It is going to set us free. It is going to bless us. Thank you Jesus. Thank you Lord. Thank you Holy Spirit. In the mighty name of Jesus. We are speaking about the ministry of angels. And I was basing on the scripture. We began with Hebrews chapter 1 and verse 14. Hebrews chapter 1 and verse 14. Uh, ah yeah. Hebrews chapter 1 and verse 14. Ichi gambo chino chali cha very Paulo. Paulo yali ayogera. This word it was Paul who was speaking. Paulo ye yawandika ebaluwa ya Hebrewia. Paul is the one who wrote the letter of the Hebrews. Yali ngabuze ekibuzo. He was as if he was asking a question. Ngabuze abebrania. He was asking the Hebrews. But you the Hebrews uh, don't you know that the angels are the ministering spirits which were sent to serve us uh-huh. and not all angels that bonasiba malaika and not all angels ministering spirits 
sent to serve those who will inherit salvation. Our sins, that's where we have based ourselves and that's where we shall continue from. And we shall say that the angels, they are the spirits that were sent. They were sent a long time ago. It is us who are not making them active or busy. It is us who forgot about yeah. them. It is us who are not caring about them. But we want to thank the Lord because this month of June we want once again the angels of God who are sent unto us who are going to inherit the kingdom of God that they will serve us as they have been serving us that they may continue. Somebody say that let them continue. But where is the Mourinha? That they may serve us. Hallelujah. Amen. We spoke in the Acts of the Apostles chapter 12. When we saw when the Lord sent an angel. He sent an angel in the life of Peter. Peter when Peter was in prison, they had even judged him to death. They had chained him. In fact, the Bible says that they chained him with two chains. I don't know what was the significance <laughs> of the two chains. I think they first got the first chain and then they got the second chain and they bound them but the Bible tells us the God and he sent the angel I say God sent the angel and he got Peter out of the prison he got Peter out of the hands of hell praise be to our God and today we want to go back to the book of Micah Mika chapter 2. Mika, we are in chapter 2. We entered into that chapter because we saw that the angel escorted Peter and he made him pass the first gate and then the second gate until he reached unto the gate of the city. The gate that was uh, by, was closing up the city. The Bible says that as he reached the gate and the gate broke open by itself. The gate opened on its own. If it took us to Micah chapter 2 and verse 13 and the verse was 13 where the Bible says the breaker has come. that the breaker of Praise be to God. That's why we want to begin from today. Hallelujah. Amen. The Bible says, Bible the breaker has come up before them. They have broken up and have passed through the gate and have gone out by it. And their king shall pass before them. And the Lord on ahead of them. Hallelujah. The Bible says these were the children of Israel. <laughs> They are where the remnant which was there. Uh -huh. They were the remnant which was there. They had gone into captivity. They had taken them to captivity in Babylon. And they were oppressed. And they made them cry. And they took every riches of theirs. And they didn't have literally anything. And even some of them died in captivity. Some died in captivity. But 
the Bible declares the word of the Lord it came through prophet Mika and God spoke to prophet go and speak to my children the who are remaining the ones who are remaining the ones who are remaining go and tell them that first says the Lord that time has come I'm going to get you out of captivity I'm going to get you out of captivity and what shows that I'm going to get you out you are not going to get out alone you are not going to get out alone I will send a breaker before you I will send a breaker before you whether it will be an angel whether it will be an anointing whether it will be the power of God whether my hand but the Bible says the breaker has come Amen. and this very month of June, of June we believe God the God who sends an angel the God who sends an angel who is going to break whatsoever who is going to break whatsoever was hindering you whatsoever was hindering you. Whatever he held you in captivity, whatsoever held you in exile, the angel breaker, which they call a breaker has come to break okumenya, every boundaries every gates every yoke Nambia, every yoke Nambia, every woes the breaker has come omumenya, and say, his name erinyari, is the angel of the Lord let us get a mighty applause from the Lord let us get an applause from the Lord the angel who broke the prison the angel who broke the prison is even here to break whatsoever hindered whatsoever hindered you whatsoever hindered us to go forward I say the breaker has come the remnant you are a few remain are you still a remnant as a child of God? Are you still remaining as a worshiper of God? Are you remaining as the one who believes God? You have not gone to the false prophet. You have not gone for the false prophet. You, you have not gone unto the witchcraft. You have not gone to Mama Fina. Even if he helps you. Someone was saying that Mama Fina so is say and Baba because it, uh -huh. even if he helps people but if he has never got saved he has to get saved <laughs> Hallelujah. don't go to Mama Fina even if he helped you go unto God remain in faith remain in the kingdom of God because it is you God is sending to the breaker it is you God is sending to an angel who is going to break whatsoever the enemy planted I say whatsoever the enemy planted every witch crop planted on your house the angel of God is going to approach them. I say every witch crop every witch crop that was planted on your house Every witch that was planted on your soul. Every witch that was planted on your soul. God is sending you an angel that is going to break it into pieces. He is going to uproot it out. Go ahead and clap those hands to the Lord. Go ahead and clap those hands to the Lord. There is a lady who was giving me the He is working somewhere. He is a safety. They told her that will you manage this place? In fact, you are shifting over to town and again somewhere. As she shifted from town and then he went somewhere. 
And the people ask her, will you be able to Yet you are born again. Whoever stays here, he has to be using something. And he told them, I'm not going to use it. I'm going to use God himself. But as the table stood he was the one who is selling in this season right His customers are running to him. Even in COVID, as the world well, they would call him. He was at home. And they would get him. Ladies and gentlemen, God has sent us a prayer. Who is going to break everything? Lady, get out of witchcraft. Woman, get out of witchcraft. You man, get out of witchcraft. Remain. As the Israel kept around, they were not worshipping the gods of God. Go ahead and the clap for the Lord. Has come. The breaker has come. The breaker has come. And the Bible says Bible they have broken up and have passed through the gate. They have broken up. They have got through the gate. We are going to break up. We are going to break out in the, spirit. in the spirit we are going to break If you have never broken out, if you have never broken through, if you have not broken through, these people. Sometimes they say that that's the saying of the but the things we tell you, we speak like Paul, that I speak of what I've seen. I've seen what I've seen. I say what I've heard. Paul spoke to the Jews that you Jews, I have the confidence because what I'm speaking about, I've I've seen him. I saw the man. And he said, you men, what I'm speaking about, I've seen it. What I'm speaking I heard it. I heard the voice of God. I was taken to the third heaven. Now what I speak, I saw him. And I heard it. And as we are speaking, from Entebbe Miracle Center, that the words were some of them we have got through. Some of them we have got through. The prophecies we have Some of them we have seen. Them. Others we have heard. And we prophesy that we are going to break up. Hallelujah. You are going to break up. In money you are going to break up. In marriage you will break up. In your job you will break up. I say you are breaking up. Nothing will ever hinder you. Nothing will hinder you. Because the breaker has come. Go oh, ahead and give it to the girl my dear. I'm proud. I say you're going to break through. You're going to break up. The prophecies will tell us you're going to break up. They will tell us you're going to break up. But even something to eat. You didn't know where you were. Yeah. You are going to break up. This has reached a Because the breaker has come. The breaker is not your husband. The breaker is not your dad. The breaker is not your girl. It's 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 not your girl. Break. He's the king of kings. Somebody say that I'm breaking up. Have you uh, been held up somewhere? Hey. Maybe you were held up somewhere. There are your things are held up. Your vehicle is it held up? Is your business You are going to break up. You are going to break up. It is going to break up. 
and your things will get through your things will get business through the your business is getting through the business the business is getting through the as we are speaking your business is breaking out Glory be to God. Glory be to God. We want to thank you for that. Which is in the Miracle Center. Because when we prophesy, God, you work it out. We are speaking tonight. As you are getting out, as you are getting through, Lord, as you are passing, even your husband, even your children, even your things. Hallelujah. These Jews, when they were coming from exile, uh, it is not only men who go, even their wives go, even the children go, even the mother-in-law go, even the mother-in-law go, mother everybody go, ladies and gentlemen, as you're breaking up, even your children are breaking up, they will not remain there, I say they will not remain there, as I'm one breaking up, even the children are breaking up, even the children are breaking up, even the children are breaking up, we 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 are breaking up, and even Abigail is breaking up. But you are breaking up. Abigail is breaking up. We are getting up. The breakers come. The breaker has come. They have gone through. By same. By same. They have gone out. By same. They have gone through. I say we are getting up. We are going to get up. We are getting through. You are getting through. Lord block you now. Every Lord block. Whatsoever was in the radio. <laughs> Hallelujah. The Bible says in Deuteronomy. In chapter one. one. I, I think I love that scripture so much. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Deuteronomy chapter one. Deuteronomy chapter one. I think chapter six. Uh, uh, chapter six. Deuteronomy chapter one and verse six. Uh, chapter 1 and verse 6 Bible the Bible says and God spoke unto the children of Israel uh -huh. verse 6 uh, that the Lord our God spoke unto us in Holeb saying you have dwelt long enough in this mountain uh -huh. turn you and take your journey and go to the mount of the Amorites and unto all the places nigh there unto in the plain, in the hills, and in the valley, and in the south, and by the seaside, to the land of the Canaanites, and unto Lebanon, and unto the great river, the river Ethrats. Hallelujah. Amen. The Bible says the children of Israel when they had got out in Egypt, when they reached and the river Mount Horeb, they sat there and they were not supposed to be there and they spent a long time they and they even built a camp. Never Zimba ne camp. And even built a camp. And they started staying there. As they were going to the camp. They were in a camp. There is not where they were. They had to continue. They had to continue. But the word of the Lord came through Moses. And Moses said, Go and tell the children. They have taken long enough. In that mountain, tell them they break, let them break out and then they continue. Advance. Let them advance. Sorry. Uh -huh. Hallelujah. They tell them to break up. camps. That let them break the camps. Let them break Every tent they are in. Let them break it. Because the breakers come. The Bible says. They broke all the tents. All the camps were broken. They advance. They continue to advance. I listen to that word. They advance. Uh-huh. 
and they are evil. Ladies and gentlemen, you are not going to continue on the one way. Way. You will not advance on the one way. You will advance and continue to advance. You will continue to advance. You are going deeper and deeper. In richness, you are going deeper. In the anointing, you are going deeper. In the revival, we are going deeper. Yeah, we, are, we are going deeper. Yes, in discovering the medicine of COVID-19, we are going we deeper. We are advancing. To gain double ziba. Yeah. To a younger ayo. To a younger ayo. Katonda yari concerned. Right. God yaf. was concerned. Hey. He spoke unto the Israel. This is not where you are supposed to yeah. be. This is not your destiny. Wano si we nkomerero ya mwe. Wano si we nkomerero yo. Si we muteke doku vera. Wano si we nkomerero ya mwe. Si wano we muteke doku vera. Si wano we muteke doku vera. You are not supposed to die Nandi in the rented room. Nandi wano si we nkomerero ya mwe. I will not die in the rented Nandi room. Nandi wano si we nkomerero ya mwe. You must not die in the rented room. You must not die in the rented room. You have to continue. No taka. And you buy land. No kure taka. After buying land. You will build a house. 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 You will build a I go through but it. But now Nane. I have advanced. Nye kakati ne yonge deyo buziba. Ne yonge la yo. Ne yonge la yo. Ate tuche yonge la yo. And I'm continuing to advance. Gamba ne yonge la yo. Somebody say I'm advancing. You are going to advance in what? You are going to advance in what? You are advancing. You are going to enlarge. You are going to enlarge. In the east. You are going to enlarge in the east. And in the west you will enlarge. You will enlarge in the north. You will enlarge in the north. You will enlarge in the south. You will enlarge in the south and in the central. Hallelujah. Somebody clap their hands to the Lord. Let me repeat this. Let me repeat this prophecy. You are not going only to advance in you. But even on the east, you are going to advance. On the west, you are going to advance. And in the south, you are going to advance. Ladies and gentlemen, you are going to advance. Because the breaker. Tugenda kuri ya msumba Joseph. Na bana bafe bagenda kuri ensi. Na bana bafe bagenda kwa yongera yo. Bagenda kwa divansinga. Bagenda kusomera masomera gama. Bagenda kubera ba ma. Bagenda kubera ba sajja ba ma. Oh 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 oh. Karona karuru ya mukama. Oh achitwara achitwara. If you are taking it. Gama banga ne yongera yo. Say that I'm a divans. Na bana banga bagenda kwa yongera yo. That even my children will advance. Bagenda kusukuru. They will excel. Rohimba lutu kirire. They song with me. Eno wange. But this side is mine. Oh now, oh now. Even this side is mine. And forward and backward. God is enlarging our territory. God is enlarging our territory. Because the breaker has come, and His angel and His man is the angel of the Lord. The breaker has come. The breaker from heaven has come. Hengaro na karuru ya mukama. Hengaro na Go ahead and come. Give a round of applause to the Lord. We are going to break out. And God had said that you are taking on. Break your camp. Break your camp. Get out. Break out. And they passed out to the other children. They continued. The Bible says. And God told them continue. Continue and take the world. The world up and down. The up and down. The ones in the valley. The ones for the Canaanites. The ones where you need to go and take them. The ones on the mountains. Those ones believe in the mountains. Ladies and gentlemen. Hallelujah. 
God is faithful. You cannot comprehend the God of your life. You cannot comprehend the God of your life. Don't complain. He said, go and take. Go and inherit the world. You are the world of the Arabs. Go and take the world of your neighbor. We professor. You are about to take the land of your neighbor. Hallelujah. Yes. Yes. Yes, the one was bewitched. Oh, no, the one who was bewitched. Oh, you you go to take the land. Oh, so you buy it? Yes, you can buy it and you We are about to take the land of our neighbors. We are about to take the land of our enemies. enemies. They will continue to have they will they never the Kaziwa. They, uh, they enlarge. Never younger Roku Kaziwa. And they continue to enlarge. Never Tuala Mataka Gariku Mountains. They took the land which was never Tuala Mataka Gari Muviwanfu. The land which was in the valley. Mananga never Kaziwa. And they continue Mananga to enlarge. Mananga never Gagawara. They became Chitu Kirire. They will come to Chitu Kirire. They will come to Chitu You will be blessed in the city. Yeah. Oh, no, we are no Mukisa Mushibuga. You will be blessed hey, in the city. Oh, no, we are no Mukisa Muviano. You will be blessed even in the village. Sumbaka yanja siwe wawo we wawo nga Tuino mukisa muchibuga Muchibuka bakuyita mugaga uh -huh. ne muchalo wa amani Checho Hallelujah Kubira katonda mungaleza amani Just go ahead and clap those Ababa ones Ababa tebukede Those ones who have seen me Ababa tebukede 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 You saw the blessing Mukama guyatua muchalo cheka yunga Which he gave us President in the town of Echuma President gave us the machine Echuma chata nisokole nanasi The machine has started working out the way the pineapple is in the plan. Why your billions and billions of money? The president gave you billions and billions of money. That's what we're talking about. Be the blessing in the world. And even in Kayunga. Yes, let us give God a mighty hand clap. The president was our angel. We are still on the topic. The breaker has come. The one who opened the gates. They shall go through. They shall go through. And open gates. In Jesus' name. Richard, today we make chapter two. Let us go back to Micah chapter two. Mukama yari concern. Mukama yari concern. God was concerned. God sometimes feels the pain. God doesn't have jealousy. Even if you have land here. And you have it at Kabonga. And you have it in Buaya. Even if you have another one in America. God is living here. He wants us to have us plenty. He wants us to be rich and then prosper. But even as our soul prosper. Even us as we prosper. Though that is the, the principle of power. When you have a lot, God is not generous. It is the devil who feels generous. But God doesn't feel generous. He wants our souls to prosper as we He wants our hearts to prosper. I want us to prosper in ministry. He wants us to prosper in anointing. He wants the churches to prosper. And even as we prosper in the spirit, in the physical, everywhere in whatsoever. Somebody say that I'm going to prosper. Because that is what God designed. The devil wants me. Shame unto you, devil. I'm going to prosper. I'm going to break up. I'm going to break up. I'm going to break up. I'm going deeper in the name of Jesus. The breakers come. They have broken up. And have passed through the gate. The breaker has opened. The Bible says that the He has opened. We want to speak about the word open. 
Chigambo kugula wo. O kugula wo. Chicheshi wa wo katonda nga gude wo. What happens when God opens? Ngabe ya gula wo gate. As he opened the gate. E yari kumuri yango gwe Yerusalimi. Which was on the gate of Jerusalem. Mwe bari basibide pita. Where they had locked up. Ngabe ya gude wo gate season now. As he opened up all Ezali the gates. Ezali mchivuga yuda. That it was in the city gate of Judah. Gate yuseya ulichivuga. He opened the gates. Mwe bari batwala. Where they had taken. Aba yuda yanga baba sibireyo. The Jews had been bound up there. Ngabe mwe kizairo. They were in exile. So come and Nagura wo. And God opened up. Uh huh. He opened up. Nagura wo. Nagura opened up. Tuwa angalo kogera kuchigambo. Open up. We want to speak about the word open up. Muli nyari ya mukama wa fe Yesu. Jesus is born. Genda matayo. I'm going to Matthew. Esura ya kusatu. Uh, it is chapter. Muli nyari ya mukama wa fe Yesu. And verse 16. Muli nyari ya mukama wa fe Yesu. In Jesus is mighty name. In the name of Jesus. Muli nyari ya Yesu. In the name of Jesus. Muli nye kure ya Yesu. Hallelujah. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Let us read the scripture. Uh, and Jesus, when he was baptized, went up straight out of the water, and lo, the heavens were open unto him, and he saw the Spirit of God descending like a dove and lightening upon him. You can continue. And lo, a voice from heaven saying, This is my beloved Son, in whom I am well pleased. We are speaking about the word open. The Bible says after Jesus was baptized when John the Baptist had baptized on the river Jordan I say on river Jordan when they had baptized they had put him in the water. They didn't just pour water on his forehead. They didn't just mean but the Bible says after he had been deep in the water. The Bible says that the heavens were rent open. The heavens were rent open. The heavens were rent open. The heavens were open. And the heavens is open. The Bible says in the heavens were open. Ama eguru eri mirundi yesa tuneri eguru. Eguru eri soka. The first seven. Eguru eri okuviri. The second heaven. Eguru eri oksatu. And even the third heaven. Tuna two three heavens. There are three heavens. What we eri soka. There is the first seven. What we eri okuviri. There is the second. What we eri oksatu. There is the third. Awo tu jako gera we nyonya nchi akuma nchi. Uh, we shall reemphasize that. But the Bible says, "Rokuja yobuka to come bring out the message." As we are about to walk, the Bible says, "Egulunere egula." And the heavens were rent open. Ngambi egulunere egula. I say the heavens were rent open. Ladies and gentlemen, egulina tero kwa gulira. Heaven is about to open for you. Tero kugula we guru kuruwo. God is about to open the heaven for you. Hallelujah. Some of us were ministering under a closed heaven. Some of us were under a closed heaven. But because the angels have come and the breakers come, God is going to open the heaven. You will begin to minister under an open heaven. The blessing of the Lord will be opened up. The Bible says that the heavens were rent open. The heavens were rent open. I say the heavens were rent open. And Jesus saw. Yesu nalaba and Jesus saw Omoyo mutukufu the Holy Spirit ngaka he was descending ngalinga he was like a sebone banyabo the bible says oluji we rumara ne rukwe guri when the door is open unto you gets mezimara ne zegura when the gates are rent open e guru we rimara ne rukwe gurira when the heavens are rent open ogenda kulaba choto labanga ko see what you have ogenda kulaba chitiwa cha mukama you will see the glory ogenda kulaba omoyo mutukufu you will see the holy you will see the anointing of the Holy Spirit. You will see the power of the Holy Spirit. You will see the favor of the Holy Spirit. You will see the Holy Spirit. The Holy Spirit is the source of everything. 
when the heavens are open and Jesus uh, and he, he saw the Holy Spirit descending. ladies and gentlemen there is something you are going to see you are going to see the waiting of your daughter you are going to see the waiting of you are about to see the waiting of your daughter you are about to see the waiting of your daughter I say you are about to see what your brothers Hallelujah The Bible says What eyes have not seen What ears have not heard Is what God has prepared for them who love him the Bible says yes, and Jesus Sorry. saw the end. he saw the Holy Spirit descend after seeing the Bible says that he had a voice he had a voice right from God saying when the heavens are the breaker open, has come the, break has the one the, who opened has come oh, yabula yabula has has it. It. the heavens are open I say you're about to hear. You're about to hear what you've never heard before. Somebody is going to call you. Somebody who has never called you is about to ring you. The one who has never called you is about to ring you. We prophesy. The Bible says, and the heavens were ready. And Jesus saw the Holy Spirit. You're going to see money you've never seen before. You're going to see a beauty you've never seen before. You will reach. There are people you are going to meet and see you have never met. You are going to see what you have never seen. And what you are going to see. It is going to come from the Holy Spirit. Hallelujah. Somebody give an applause to the Holy Spirit. The Bible says. And he had a voice. He had a voice. There is something you are going to hear. There is a new voice you are going to hear. You are going to hear the voice of God. A voice of joy. We are prophesying. The voice of The voice of The voice of We declare the voice of The voice of peace. The voice. From heaven when it is loud. You're about to hear it. I say you're about to hear it. You're about to hear the voice. When the heavens are open, open up. When the heavens went open. You hear what you have never heard before. Oh, hey, you are about Everybody. to hear the husband putting you up. He will lift you and speak good things. Hallelujah. Let us speak May God richly bless you. In the name of Jesus. And the heaven open. And Jesus saw the spirit of the Lord. Descending from above. <laughs> Descending from above, and he heard a voice from heaven saying, This is my beloved son, whom I'm well pleased. You're going to rejoice in May this. May God richly bless in Jesus you. In Jesus' name, I will still remain your minister right from Entebbe Miracle. For sure, we'll deal aloud. Don't forget to be someone mindful of the kingdom of God. So a seed in the kingdom of God. Continue to pray for the kingdom of God. Support the work of the Lord. Seek God as you build up the kingdom in the mighty name of Jesus. Let us clap and give God an applause. Amen.